Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel and this is me again, your teacher Russell. It's been a long time since I uploaded videos here on YouTube. It's because I just got really, really busy. Uh, and with all the COVID-19, oh my god, my life was tough. <laughs> and also, I am actually working full-time in a company, so I'm really, really busy today. Actually, I've been getting some comments like, when are you gonna upload again? And I'm like, oh, I've got 8,000 subscribers and it's not growing. My son also told me, when am I gonna upload another video? Because he really wants my subscribers to increase and I'm like, okay. So maybe I should try again next time. But actually, I really miss teaching you guys and I miss your comments and I miss interacting with people. So actually, I decided to make another video again starting today. So before, I used to upload videos every week, but because of my busy schedule, I might do it twice a month. Yes, but at least I'm not gonna stop doing this because I really love teaching English and I love sharing my knowledge to you guys and I'm, I'm really hoping that you could learn something from me as your English teacher. So, in this lesson, I will give you 10 words that would actually replace this phrase very good all the time. And I'm gonna use it in a sentence for you to be able to see how it is actually used in sentences as well. Word number one, instead of saying very good, you can say great. So instead of saying teacher, you have a very good English speaking skills. So instead of that, you can say teacher, you have a great English speaking skills. Word number two, brilliant. So again, instead of saying very good, we can say brilliant. You have a brilliant idea. You are a genius. You have a brilliant idea. Word number three is excellent. For example, instead of saying, you have a very good taste when it comes to wine, you better say, you have an excellent taste when it comes to wine. Oh, how I miss drinking wine. I've never had wine in such a long time either. Oh my God. Our next word is terrific. Let's use it in a sentence. Instead of saying, you have a very good sense of humor. So you better say, you have a terrific sense of humor. I love people with really good sense of humor because they make me happy and they make me laugh. I really want those people. Do you have a good sense of humor? Prove it by writing your comment down below. The next word is wonderful. In my online classes, I usually say, you did a very good job today, but also we can replace it with wonderful. So we can say, you did a wonderful job today. Sounds better, right? The next words are also used when you are trying to describe someone. So we use this as an adjective describing someone how very good they are. So we can also say something like adorable. So instead of saying you look very good today, you can say you look adorable. Adorable is the word. Or let's say you saw your favorite K-pop idol and you really admire these people and instead of saying they are very good at dancing, they are very good at singing, you can say they are so admirable. They're so good at dancing and singing. So we can use admirable in that situation. Another word as a replacement for very good is wonderful. For example, you met a friend at a party and you wanna say, oh, you look very good tonight. You can say, you look wonderful. You look wonderful in your dress. Your dress suits you well. You look wonderful. That's the word. Another word for very good is lovely. For example, you actually saw a cute puppy. And instead of saying, oh, you have a very good puppy. It looks very good. You can say, your puppy looks so lovely. Your puppy looks lovely. You can say lovely as well instead of saying very good. Another common word as a replacement for very good is awesome. Instead of saying, oh, you look so beautiful, you look very good in that outfit, you can say, you look awesome in that outfit. Another way of saying very good is, you can say lit, that's lit. For example, you're playing online game with your friend and he seemed to be really, really good at playing it. Instead of saying, you're playing really good, you're playing really well, you can rather say, you're lit. And lastly, we can also say, cool. 
I just mentioned it a while ago. Instead of saying you're very good at doing something, you can say you're so cool at doing this. You're the best at doing this. You're cool. Yeah, I think that's one of the coolest words you can say. I say that. My son loves saying that. You're cool. Okay, so, well, I guess we're done with this lesson for today. And it's just a really short video. But I really hope that you learned a lot from me again today. So, you know, in order to avoid repetition, it's really good to be able to learn a lot of different vocabulary words that are suited for different kinds of situation as well so i guess that's it well if you're new to my channel please go ahead click that subscribe button show your support by writing your comments i'm gonna see you again after two weeks thanks for having me again this is your teacher russell have a nice day goodbye